The first step is to cut circles for your flowers. You want three or four layers for each set of petals. The next step is to cut little pointy petals from the layers of fabric. You'll do this with all three layers. These are very casual. I just kind of put my thumb in the center and use that as a sort of a guide of how far to in to cut. Once you've cut all these, just kind of turn them around, turn them over, shift them so that they don't line up, and that will give your flower a, a looser, fluffier look that will be more natural. After I've rearranged the various layers, I stitch through the center of the flower, making two or three little anchoring stitches. I use a double thread for this project. I want the strength. Once I have a couple of stitches in, working from the back, I put a couple of little folds and make a couple of little pleat stitches. This will make the flower petals stand up. There we have three. Then I pick up the next section of flower, shift it around to suit myself, and there we go. Run your needle through the center and repeat this procedure. Just put some little pleat stitches in. Now I'm working on the last layer, just putting a couple of more pleats in it. And then knotting it off. When you're finished, you'll have something like this. To stitch it to your banner, just peel a few layers back and stitch around here, all the way around, and that will anchor it sufficiently. Another use for this would be to put a little pin back on here, just stitch it on, and it makes a nice little casual flower to wear on a blouse or a sweatshirt or something like that.